I've just took two or three steps away from that uh, last piece of lead we've just found and there's something else there. So we'll just uh, pinpoint it first, so we'll bring the coil back. Okay, so it's just in front of the coil. Push the coil through, that's the, where the centre stem. It's now at the back of the coil. So back to the centre of the stem. Let's walk round. Dig me, dig me, all the way around. That's a dig me. All the way around that fella's solid, solid signal. Let's just see. Uh, yeah, and there's still another five or six inches above the ground. It's still, still hitting that. So a good, a good tone, a good solid signal. No break up all the way around. Still in the. Uh, in the hole. It's very uh, sludgy, fellas. It's where the uh, where the cattle have been uh, walking, uh, walking up, and with the rain, they've uh, made it look a bit boggy and and sticky, really. So, oh, there it is. See it there. Look right on the edge. Okay. Let's, uh, let's just give that a little measure again I think three or four inches just fell out the edge there look so that's uh, that's a good four inches there and bear in mind that was just on its edge so that target was probably presenting at an angle rather than being flat in the bottom of the hole um, and there was no mistaking that that was a target it's a, it's another penny. Nineteen, nineteen twenty something, twenty one I think. Looks like a nineteen twenty one. Bit twisted, lot. A little bit of a something's uh, caused it to twist. And there we go. Good old George. So again. We've hit on it, found it, easy peasy, lemon squeezy.